scientists just confirmed there was some form of trade between Easter Island and South America in ancient times. On March 20th, a team of archaeologists published a paper stating that they had found signs of sweet potatoes, breadfruit, and ginger on obsidian blades that were used by Easter Islanders about a thousand years ago. These are all foods that were thought to have been introduced to Easter Island much later. On the tools, they found starch grains of these plants that were identified with a 90% certainty. These blades were found in different layers, one of which being the oldest known cultural layer on the island, which means that these plants quite possibly came over with the initial settlers of Easter Island. All these plants share a couple characteristics. They propagate without seeds and their edible portion travels well. Genetic studies on humans have shown some evidence that Easter Islanders and South Americans tended to interact fairly frequently in ancient times, and this paper tends to support that notion. So we're finally getting a handle on the peopling of Easter Island, and the story is much more complex than many previously thought. I'll make a full length video on this soon, but since this sounds a little Graham Hancockian, I figured I'd better hurry up and get something out before the paper gets retracted. 